Just, I wanted to ask you about your views, uh, about your views for the next incarnation. And we read that somewhere you have written that this is the last incarnation. And okay. like, what do you think okay. about the next incarnation of the oh. Dalai Lama? A few years ago, <coughs> in America, when I meet some media people, one asked me about uh, reincarnation. And then. I took away my glass and looked at his face. Uh, judging my face, is it quite hurry or not? <laughs> <laughs> then he said, oh, no hurry. <laughs> <laughs> so some, some Chinese hardliner, you see, they actually you see, express about the 15th Dalai Lama. So they have to wait another, at least, I think, uh, 30, 40 years. They have to wait. <laughs> then, of course, the, the, the reincarnation of Dalai Lama, future of Dalai Lama, is ultimately my own hand. Huh? At the time of my death, I will write some will. So my rebirth, uh, uh, certainly, I think, some, somewhere, a Buddhist community. So, so, as early as 69, I made clear, even the institution of Dalai Lama should continue or not, up to Tibetan people. Not important. Buddhist reincarnation, no, not there, Buddhist reincarnation. But Buddha's teaching remain. All these Narendra Master, they have no institution, no reincarnation, uh, officially because of recognized reincarnation, but their teaching, their text still remain. So, uh, my own case, I think some books I wrote and a number of sort of books which recorded my talk. So these, so after my death, these remain. So these teaching not totally depend on individual person, but the text or the teaching like that. So I'm not much worried. Thank you.